I finally have a boyfriend now. Yeah, he's white. You're welcome. <laughs> he is white. This is how white he is. He's from Wisconsin. That's like aggressively white. You know what I'm saying? Like they drink milk over there, like with dinner. You know what I mean? That's like that's really really white. And he has never dated a, a, a non-white woman before me ever in his whole life. All of his past girlfriends were blonde with big boobs. And so now he says really sweet things to me like, honey, your people used to freak the shit out of me. <laughs> but now I love getting my nails done. <laughs> so romantic. He is so romantic, this guy. <laughs> I usually do end up dating white guys, not because I am racist, but because my butt is like Goldilocks. Check it out. It is not enough butt for black and Latino men, right? Brothers out there, right? <laughs> They're like, where is it? Oh my God, it curves in. I know, not enough butt for black and Latino men, but way, way too much butt for Asian guys. Right, buddy? He's like, what is that? It's huge, I know. <laughs> this thing makes me the Korean Kim Kardashian. I, I'm like, I am like the Beyonce of Asia with this thing. It's a bubble butt. And I'm stacked. <laughs> These are ginormous Asian titties. <laughs> I go to Asia and businessmen try to motorboat me on the street. <laughs> They're like, ah, oh, so. <laughs> I'm like, it's just a B cup, calm down. It's just a B cup. <laughs> My. <laughs> This white boyfriend that I have is very serious with him. He is the only boyfriend in my life to ever meet my parents, which is very serious. And this is how it went down. Uh, he was staying at my place. My parents flew in from out of town. And I don't know if you guys know this about immigrants, but they don't rent hotel rooms to save their lives. <laughs> like no matter what, it, oh, pay for sleeping? No way, why? <laughs> they don't do it. So now all four of us are supposed to sleep together in my tiny one bedroom apartment. And my mom's like, Helen, where did you everybody gonna sleep? And I'm like, well, mom, you and dad can sleep in the bedroom and David and I can sleep in the living room. And she goes, oh my God, oh my God. <laughs> you sleeping together? And I was like, well, you're not gonna rent a hotel room, so what's your idea? And she goes, oh, okay, Helen, I have a better idea. Uh, you and the mommy, we sleeping together in a bedroom, and David and Danny sleep together on a futon. I'm like, bitch, are you crazy? You want this poor white Wisconsin boy who drinks milk to climb into bed with a 70-year-old Korean man that he's never met before? How is that gonna work? Are they gonna sleep head to foot? Are they gonna build an awkward wall with pillows? <laughs> My dad's gonna climb into bed in his old man jammies, like, okay, baby, the nice to meet you, good night. No homo. No homo, no funny stuff. <laughs> <laughs>